The sport is exploding in popularity, but not everyone is a fan of pickleball. The problem is the noise. Tonight, people who live next to a court in South Surrey are rallying opposition, calling on City Hall to send pickleball packing. CTV Sinjin Alexander has the story. Sure, it's all the rage, but the noise. Oh! Downright irritating, says Joanne Spruce. It makes her shiver. All of a sudden, it's clack, 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 and ho, 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 yeah, ha, ha, ho, 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 and swear, swear, swear. She and some 300 people who live in the apartment buildings next door loved the sound of people playing tennis. But two years ago, many of those courts in Crescent Park were converted to pickleball. Okay, this morning there are 24 pickleball players out here. Way too close. The guy that lives in that corner apartment is, is going nuts with the noise. They've complained to the city, presented their case to Parks and Recreation, and there is precedent. Residents in Victoria hated the noisy courts so much in James Bay, they were banned in Todd Park. Do you think that your concerns were taken seriously? No. I do not. I don't think they give a damn about us. Well, the city of Surrey tells CTV News it is. Hours have been reduced, and the game will soon be moved to brand new courts that are being built away from homes. Uh -huh. <laughs> well played, say these friendly couples, who agree the game is noisy, and say they will gladly take their paddles up the road so that everyone's a winner. Sinjin Alexander, CTV News, Crescent Beach.